What's going on? So you already know I'm back running my mouth like I always do. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving y'all a little, a little juice this morning. So y'all make sure y'all hit that like, comment, and subscribe, okay? Give, 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 give me something. Don't just leave here with nothing. I thought I gave you a giggle or two. Anyways, let's get into uh, a Liv. Liv thought she was a big girl. Liv thought she could just jump off that porch like that. When she ain't never been off the porch before. Live through the humility, humility, her humbleness away. Picked up a rent mortgage that she wasn't going to be able to afford. Sat there and flexed. Got the, got the subscribers to them. Donate, uh, pay for things, send things, give what they can, honey. Got all kinds of dough from y'all. All cause she lied. Lie, y'all. Now y'all tell me, how does that make y'all feel? This lady right here in the moving truck, right here on this uh live. She trying to, she tried to hide and condone and, and all that. But baby, you want to put that stuff in a uh in a uh what you call it? A uh, uh storage unit or something? I or, or you flexing with you playing with us. You know what I'm saying? Like she playing our faces too much. Like we really don't know what's going on because she playing our faces too much. And it's just a shame. Okay? It make me it make me wonder what she really was doing to that man, honey. What made him want to leave. You feel me? You play too many mental games, too many roller coaster rides, too many um, uncertainties with you. I, I I wouldn't be comfortable giving the rest of my life to you for real, neither, boo. I'm just going to be honest. It ain't right that he left them kids, which I'm starting to believe that he ain't really leave them kids. You just don't want that man around them kids. You don't want him to take his his kids to Texas because you afraid that he going to have them around somebody else. Meanwhile, you going to do the same thing. But nigga come pull up on you today and you and the way you acting, you'll have him living up in there in, in two weeks. And then uh, you going to be uh, letting him play daddy to your kids. Meanwhile, they got a daddy up the goddamn street. Just cause he uh, um, gone and he left you didn't mean don't mean he left them kids, child. What you should have did was let Christian go with his daddy. A single mom, a single bitter mom should not raise no boy if she don't got to. Say what you want to say. I just feel like you just not gonna be emotionally stable. You know what I'm saying? And and she's showing us that she's not. She's showing us that she's not emotionally stable. Me, I was, I feel like when you, when a woman who in live position, who never has lived on her own, never has had nothing on her own, never have experienced life on her own, I feel like it's selfish of her to pick her kids up and uh, take them away, bounce them back around and do all that stuff that she's doing. That is selfish instead of leaving them with their daddy so they can just have some kind of stability, some kind of person just staying in their life, somebody that's mentally, emotionally stronger than you because now they're seeing all this around behavior so i know they ain't sleeping it good at night they running you they running you ragged they probably tr treating you in ways that that man was treating you or that y'all or how y'all was treating each other that's just how it goes when you are when you when when husband and wife aren't on one accord the kids aren't on one accord It's just a shame that you are so cool with putting this on blast and looking crazy for a check, bro. Like I'm I'm just I am just floored by that. It is very distasteful. But let's get into this uh LSA information about this house. Okay, y'all. This the proof right here that Liv is a liar, a, a cheater, a deceiver, heartbreaker, and I won't take it back in my life. So I'm taking the house, the keys, the cars. I want it all. You're nothing but a liar, a cheater, a fool, heartbreaker, whatever. <laughs> y'all know what I'm talking about. But baby, this Trump supporting ass live. She done lied to y'all folks, got y'all sending her things to, to, about this house, honey, that she done got rid of in less than 30 days. That lady bit off more than she could chew. And that's okay, because we all do. We all bite off more than we could chew sometimes. But, baby, you said you put $13,000 down on this house. 
you say it, that you purchased this house, okay? But this house back up for rent, baby. Down there in Clearwater, Florida somewhere, it's back there up for rent for $19.95 a month, the people say. The people, they slide in the comments saying that you a liar, then the LSA putting all your business out. You know, I, I'm hoping that it's not true that you got caught in a lie because I'm sorry it's getting old. Um, but at this rate, I would not be surprised, you know. At this rate, it's kind of typical. Y'all see all these things they saying? I slowed it down so y'all can read them at y'all own pace, baby. You see this Olivia? She was in a lease to own arrangement. And on lease to own arrangements, you have to show that you can rent them houses first for like a year or two. Then after you show that you can rent it and pay that rent, then after that you can be eligible to per you know to purchase that home. And then they do some things to figure it out about, you know, when you paid and all those details. But you got to you gotta be able to afford that rent for a while first before you just do lease to own. And Liv was not expecting that ticket. And she damn sure wasn't expecting to have that ticket alone. So that's why we ain't noticing, you know, the inconsistency hey, yo, or whatever. You go crazy. I'ma put this shit down then, today. I'ma put this shit down today. All she can say was my house, my house, my house, my house, my house, but now it's Clearwater House. This is the state of Florida house back now. It's the management company house back now. Because you couldn't afford to pay the $2,000 a month that it was it was going forward. And I'm sorry, y'all can say whatever y'all want to say. That lady was in a moving truck on that live, honey. A moving truck. I will put it up, but I'm already thinking I'm going to get screened. I'd rather make some money. Y'all see my bank. Y'all going over there, flipping in the boutique on Instagram, and, and see what we got going on. I ain't, I ain't got too much for y'all on this information. We all knew that lady was lying. We There's all knew Liv was lying. We all knew that. We all know. Back in the days, our grandmas and our mama used to say, whatever you do in the dog, gonna come to the light, baby. And it's gonna shine bright. And I'm sorry, y'all. I'm not glad to see no woman's downfall. But all that shit she talked about, strong mommy Chrissy, I'm glad to see some shit happening to her. Y'all have a great day. Like, comment, and subscribe.